Holy smash! PewDiePie has been overtaken by T-Series for 11 hours yesterday. T-Series overtook PewDiePie on yesterday so what is my thought on it well well at one point I realized that they were going to overtake PewDiePie some point or other but despite that how did it all start it first overtake took him in 22nd of February 2019, then in March the 19th, and so on. It just so happened that on the 21st of March, T Series passed PewDiePie for 11 and a half hours. So, so what is my thoughts on it? Well, even if it did overtake PewDiePie, it would still be the number one channel on YouTube. And before it got close to PewDiePie, it was getting like 10k subscribers and PewDiePie was getting like 20k subscribers 20,000 but back then T-Series wasn't that well known in the western world it was until it, when it not close to him, it did so, and and uh, overall, it had yeah, both them have about ninety subscribers. So I'm not sure whether if PewDiePie would. be the first to reach 100,000 100 million subscribers before the series where it's possible and so on overall This side of that T-Series and PewDiePie have been getting the equal amount of subscribers like 150 subscribers a day and all that. Despite that. Anyway, why would PewDiePie will be the number one channel on YouTube? Well, T-Series is it's a large corporation, a company, not a YouTuber, and all that. Anyway, I previously unsubscribed from PewDiePie. Um, because Well, years ago, he used to be funny, he used to make things like stay off some bros or, or something, or how's it going? My name is PewDiePie. Oh. But that was then, oh, he doesn't make those intros anymore, and he was making up all those edgy, edgy jokes and all that. Well, that was then, this is now. 
and that's what they were all I want to say. It's just a few months till Bob PewDiePie reach 100 million. Okay? Anyway guys, don't subscribe to PewDiePie, don't subscribe to T-Series, subscribe to my channel. As always, See you soon.